Prescription of drugs by unqualified persons in the country is on the rise, posing a danger to the health of Kenyans. A concern that has caught the attention of the Kenya Pharmaceutical Association with the Secretary General James Gidinji calling upon the government to employ trained personnel attributing the rise in deaths, medical complications and abuse of drugs to poor prescriptions dispensed by quacks. The ratio of pharmaceutical service provision in Kenya stands at 1 to 6,000 patients against the World Health Organization recommendation ratio of 1 to 2,000 patients. Particularly in over 3,700 health facilities, that is health centers and dispensaries, that are in, in need of pharmaceutical technologies to dispense drugs. Every such facilities, facility requires at least two pharmaceutical technologies. That means that we have a direct shortage of personnel of 7,000. Addressing the press in Mombasa, Gidinji also urged the government to impose stiffer penalties to culprits, terming the prescription of drugs by unqualified officer as an offense. It is an offense for other persons, other than the registered all enrolled pharmacies stroke pharmaceutical technologies, to sell possess or had a medicine both in public and private sector. KPA has also expressed concern on the VAT bill aimed at increasing the cost of drugs, especially the insulin-based drugs, saying the move will not only impede the affordability but compromise on the provision of healthcare services and access to prescription drugs to the people. Irene Mchuma Odim. The news at one.